so a, a push down automata is given for us where q1 and q2 are the set of states a comma b is sigma a and z naught are the tape symbols delta is the transition which is defined as there are six transitions given for us let me number it 1 2 3 4 5 6 six transition given for us q naught is the initial state z naught refers to the bottom of the stack and f refers to final state now we need to construct or or convert this push down automata to its equivalent context free grammar with pt vtps now your t is equivalent to the set of symbols and s is going to be the start symbol now we will define the set of productions set of productions for each of this transitions given now looking into the transition the first transition is a push operation second one is also push operation third one is just a move operation neither push nor pop and these are all pop operations we have two two for each one of this now we'll try to construct according to the rules described in the previous lecture we will try to uh, give the productions for each of this transition taking the first one delta of q naught comma a comma z naught it is equal and equal to q naught comma a z naught so as i have mentioned in previous lecture since there are two uh, stack symbols here we will be having four set of productions associated with it so for the single transition you will be having four set of productions associated so let me make a note of it so since the initial state is q naught we will make q naught here we will copy q naught here and since you have z naught here bottom of the stack it comes in the middle stack symbol will come in the middle and this you need to consider all possible states you have two states so there will be two possibilities for q naught and two possibilities for q1 now coming here if we have two stack symbols then you will have two boxes like this with the middle taking one of the stack symbols that we have seen in previous lecture so a a is it not like this a is it not now this a should come before okay now it is moving to state q naught so q naught should be occupied here okay so from q naught to q naught so this two should be one and the same q naught you try for next possibility so q naught q naught q1 these are the two possibilities now q1 means q1 it can be q naught q1 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 so this is how we will fill with all possibilities that is various possibilities rk i am talking in if we map with the rule that is given for us then this or all possible combinations we need to fill in up like this now taking the second production second production is i'm sorry second transition is q naught b a it is equal to q q naught comma a a q naught comma a a here again you have two stack symbols here so there will be four possibilities four possible productions so here this initial state will be filling up and the stack symbol here is a and all possibilities q naught q naught q1 q1 tending to this b will be copying here with two boxes in between a 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 now this q naught you have to copy here this q naught so q naught q naught q1 now this q naught this q naught q naught q naught q1 
naught. Here it will vary Q naught Q1. Q1, 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 Q1. These two should be one and the same. Okay. Q naught, Q1. So all possibilities we have identified and make, made a note of, note of it. Now coming to the third one. Delta of Q naught comma B comma A. Third rule. Third transition. Delta of Q naught comma B comma A. Which tends to Q1 comma A I think. Q1 comma A right. Q1 comma A. See here you have only one stack symbol. So there will be only two boxes. So this symbol you make Q naught Q naught. This A you will have. Here Q naught Q1. Two possibilities. This B you will be cop copying. Q. This is Q1 because this only we need to copy here. A Q0 you will have again Q1 A Q1. Now fourth one is delta of Q1 comma B comma A tending to Q1 comma A. I will check. Yeah. Q1 comma B comma A is equal to. So since you have one stack symbol here, you will be having two productions. Sorry, here it, it has to be 1 because this is the initial state here. 1 A Q1 tending to B. This state should be coming here. Q1 A Q0 again B of Q1 A Q1. Now move symbol is over. Next is Q1 comma A comma A tending to Q1 comma Epsilon. If Epsilon is coming, you will be having only one production which is this Q1, this A and this Q1, right? Q1 tending to A. Again, sixth production, delta of Q1 comma epsilon comma Z0, Q1 comma epsilon. So this Q1, middle Z0 and that Q1. This Q1 you will write here and then tending to epsilon. So here comes the end of converting all transition to the set of productions. We have followed the rule. Okay. But we have failed to introduce one production. That is start symbol production. That we should have introduced first. Start symbol is always Q0, Z0 and P. What is this P? This P belongs to capital Q. In our case, this Q is equal to Q0, Q1. So start symbol production we have to include Q0, Z0, Q0 and S goes to Q0, Z0, Q1. So these two are start symbol production. Sorry, this has to be uh, said as the first rule. And after that for every uh, transition we will have a set of production rules like this. See, I hope this clear, this example is clear for you. Thank you.